purpose of gathering or for making some kind of talks. But yes, we all are in that phase where we are witnessing a lot of tremendous changes in the education and the curriculum is on the verge of revamp altogether. After 34 years of the NEP uh, 2020 that we have been taking up in true stance now, this is very challenging for us that how we can give those uh, uh, dimensions that have been mentioned in the NEP to you in proper sense, in true meaning. So when we talk about the holistic education, we have been talking about 3H. As Neha has already said, head, heart and hands. On a very important topic of uh, emotional intelligence. As we all know that whether, whatever profession you take up, we are having the gathering of uh, the budding professionals, whether uh, budding professionals from health sciences, from engineering, from agriculture, from various backgrounds. Whatever profession you choose, in your professional life, and even in your personal life also, if you want to become successful, you need to have three things in you. You need to develop it. If you do not have, then you need to develop it. One is your mindfulness, number two is your selflessness, and number three is your compassionate. You need to be compassionate. And to develop these three qualities in you, you need to have the emotional intelligence, for which we have invited our eminent guest speaker, Ms. Anuradha Chavla, who will be delivering a session and will be guiding you how you can develop this emotional intelligence. Being a student like all of you, what I did in my school was, I was a very intelligent student. I never attended a class. <laughs> I'm telling you, honestly, seriously, I was a sports person. I was a lot of prestigious sports, sports, sports. So I was doing every time basketball, short foot, high jump, long jump, javelin throw, just to play. To the point, in 10th class, I had to go to my class, so I went to my class and sir entered. One thing I learned in life is, like you say, Atithi Devu Bhayo, we have said one thing from the beginning, Guru Brahma, Guru Vishnu, Guru Devo Maheshwala. Guru Saksha Param Brahma, Tasme Shri Guru Vena. So, I always respect you. Now, the class is coming, so I have to sit down. So, I sat. But one show was also in the kids. It was made. So, the sir said, you, stand up. I looked at it like intelligent kids. The sir said, yes, you, who is not in your head. I thought that I was a sportsman of the year, I was getting a lot of time, so I will do something like that. Get out of my class. It's a lot of fun. We're talking about emotions, right? What are these emotions? These emotions are our emotional desire. And this desire is not now. We have an upbringing. You've been 20 years old, right? So this is 20 years old. Upbringing. And before that, your karmic karma, which is your old past life, I don't know how many thousands of years are going. Right? That is also your emotional desires. What is emotional desire? Acknowledgement, appreciation, belongingness, love, recognition, acknowledgement, everything. It's so weight, it's so big list, it's a tall list of emotions, emotional desires. और ये डिजायर्स हमारे अपग्रेडिंग हमारे कंडीशन में लेकिन डू यू नो ये जो इतनी लंबी इमोशंस की लिस्ट है ना ये हमको बहुत ज़्यादा बर्डन कर रही है क्यों ये सारे इमोशंस हमारे अंदर से फिर नहीं हो रहे हैं कहाँ से हैं डिपेंडेंसीज ऑन आउटर राइट बाहर की चीज़ें आउटर सोर्सेस चाहे जो ह्य चाहे ये सोशल मीडिया पे बड़ी सारी हमारी जो फोटो लगती है, I was just thinking and getting married to these posters, मुझे बड़ा मजा आ रहा था, है ना? So I am also guilty. So क्या है ये सब? हमें outside factors पे depend करा रही है। कल TNU ने ऐसा next time मेरे नहीं किया, तो मेरे दिल में चोट लगेगी। इस बार तो इज्जत ही नहीं हुई, कम हो गई।
the same time, let's say my mom is paying for a pizza. And we are three siblings. Right? Pizza ke che piece hone hai. I want a non-veg pizza, but my siblings are vegetarians. That is where you have to imply. Kaha par selfishness ko nichi, kaha selfish ko ta. Ab waha pe me bolte nahi, mein to pizza hi khaungi. Ab meri mammi ke paas chhe, so rupai hi hai. वो एक ही पिज्जा ले सकती है तो वो एक बच्चे को खुश करेंगे कि चार लोग खाएं वहां पर यू हैव टू अंडरस्टैंड कंपैशन राइट सो दैट इज वेयर आई सेट सेल्फ अवेयरनेस सेल्फ रेगुलेशन सोशल स्किल्स सो यू हैव टू पुट दो स्किल्स इनटू प्रैक्टिस कि कब क्या करना है है ना अगर मैंने कपड़े लेने हैं मैं अपनी चॉइस के ले रही हूं बट अगर मुझे एक जॉइंट मील एंजॉय करनी है आई वुड रादर ऑर्डर अ क्ले पॉट that all four of us can eat or a pizza that everyone can eat. So that is where your cognitive intelligence comes in practice. So you have to have both IQ and EQ. IQ will tell you the purse, what, what the purse has, how much the pizza cost and EQ will tell you that I have to be compassionate to all the people here, right? But when I preach, I always say that be kind to yourself too. Thank you.